again. This is Craig with Phonics Haven. Glad you are back with us. Alright, this is a video on my greenhouse and the update on it. Oh, I am pretty much finished plumbing it out. I've got the NFT systems done. Um, I've got my towers done and they are ready to be planted. I've got some stuff, seeds planted, waiting for them to come up. Um, I should have already put them in and had them growing, but I procrastinated. So, uh, what's today? Uh, last week I planted them. <laughs> so, um, but anyway. I'm going to show you around my greenhouse what I've got done. So, please, before we get started, please like the like button down below. Come on. I know you can do it. Come on now. Come on. Help me out. Hit that like button. We're not going any further. Come on, hit it. You can do it. Thank you. Thank you very much. It helps out a lot. Thank you so much. Alright, subscribe to our channel if you hadn't already. And you'll get, every time we come out with a video, you will get, and if you hit the notification, you will get a notif notification on when we got a video. So without further ado, here's my update on the greenhouse. Alright, I'm sorry for the noise, the, the coolant, the evaporated cooling wall, which is working very well, is running, and that's what you hear. The, um, as you, well, it just shut off. It's cool enough. As you can see, both of these are running. Both of them are running. This is the one on the left when you walk in. You've already seen that. The tables are level. It's all plumbed in, glued in, everything is is where it needs to be. Okay. All the plumbing is glued in. So it is it is where it needs to be. Now, if you look right here, if you look down the center, you will see my grow towers. They are not running right now because I have not finished the electrical for it and I'm not running everything at one moment. I'm just running the um, the NF, NFT systems. So, but here's that, um, here's a look at that. As I said, that it will be part of my system and I'm in it. That um that jug plastic jug tower it is part of my system and it will be planted with everything else. But anyway, here's the setup of that. setup of that now I'm gonna walk this is the other one as it two are connected together it goes down it is 17 and 17 or 17 on each one so you got 34 39 plants that can be planted on this side. 
I think that's right. 17 and 17. No, that's 34. My doing math on YouTube on a video is a no-no. Fans just kick back on. Now, what I did with the drain, what it does is it goes down right there, up underground, okay? And it comes up over here. And runs into right there. And you ask the reason why I did that is that they are going to be running 24-7. Give you a look down this way of it. Okay. See if I can get you see the water level there. I don't know if you can see the water level. I got the water level to it's about I would say within three quarters of an inch from the top. Okay. When I put them in there, they're going to already have roots. So, what I have planted here, when I'm planting on, I've got some peppers, I've got, i got a few peppers, banana peppers and bell peppers. I also have some ruckers, I've got some Cherokee purples, I've got some... Oh man. Brandy wine and some beef steaks and some uh I can't think of the name of them that but they are the the sauce tomatoes. Can't think of what they're called. But I also have Black Seeded Simpson, um, Bib, Bib um, Romaine, uh, Planted. So, yeah, they're starting to come up. But that is a look at my greenhouse. And everything is running good. And I'm happy. So, we are happy with it, and so we are going to be getting set up. Alright, we're going to be getting this thing set up for too long, get it planted. Now, the, the, the stuff that I'm going to be, the solution I'm going to be using is um, from the Grow Growers, Go Growers, Go Growers Solution. I am going to use the Go Growers Solution that they have sent me to um, to use. I'm going to use it in the, the lettuce and I'm going to use it in the big barrel. Now, they did it in the five and a half gallon and the three and a half gallon. I'm going to use the five and a half gallon for the lettuce I'm gonna use it for that and we're gonna see what happens with the lettuce okay and and I'm going to 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 try to get the the pH right the um the PP PPI PPR whatever it is uh, I can't remember I'm messing up. I know I am on YouTube, so I'm going to get corrected down below. <laughs> but anyway, peace.
PPR, PPM, whatever it is. Um, I'm gonna get all that where it needs to be in the in the guidelines that they say it needs to be in, uh, and um, we're gonna give it the best chance it has, and we're gonna grow with it and see what happens. And um, like I said, we're gonna and after that, we're gonna be giving some of this away to some some viewers. So. But I'm going to use something different on the, the um, tomatoes because they're such a big, that, that is a 60 gallon tank there. So I need more than just 5 gallon. That takes a whole lot of, whole lot of packages. But anyway, we are going to be doing that. So stay tuned for that. And we will see you in the next video. Until then, may the good Lord shine upon you and bless you. Jesus' name.